My name is Bill Lipscomb, and I'm a senior research scientist in the Climate and Global Dynamics Laboratory at NCAR. I joined NCAR recently in 2017. Uh, before that, I was a scientist at Los Alamos National Lab, where I worked a lot with NCAR people for, for many years. Uh, my research here is mostly on land ice, uh, specifically the Greenland Antarctic ice sheets, and how they interact with the climate and could change in the future. Well, I'll be talking about ice sheets and sea level, so specifically how it is that uh, the Greenland Antarctic ice sheets are losing mass and are likely to continue to lose mass and, and raise sea level all over the world. Well, there's uh, hundreds of millions of people around the world who live very close to sea level, uh, whose lives would be disrupted if sea level keeps going up. And uh, we don't know, we know sea level's rising, but we don't know how much and how fast in the future. And the more we can inform people about uh, how fast sea level's gonna rise and what they can expect, uh, the better they can make good decisions and, and, and plan. I'd like people to understand how ice sheet works, what their dynamics is, how they interact with the climate, and how, although for the last two or three million years, ice sheets have changed for natural reasons, uh, changes in the Earth's orbit, for example, uh, the changes that are happening now have a different trigger, and in a lot of ways are, are more concerning and could be larger and more severe than the, than the past changes.